race 28 is a two and a half mile hurdle or well, it's not a two mile five furlong hurdle at the top we've got Andalie Ebb Crescent for Derek Hinton Disco Inferno Matt Cooper It's a Game of Inches Joshua Sorland Roll of Six Craig Beckwith Baby Jane David Robertson Dressed Grey and James Shea and a rhythmic room for Alex Cherry called in and away just a seven on this time as they head towards the first It's a game of inches is the early leader. Baby Jane in second. And Disco Inferno third. Closest to us in the pink jacket is under Lieb Crescent. And they're pretty tightly grouped. They've got 11 flights to take this time. And they're all safely over the first. Although Dressed Grain and Roller 6 were a little bit slow. Pretty sure Roller 6 was around last season. She didn't manage a win. If he was. It's a game of inches is in the lead. Oh, down on his nose there was under Liam Crescent. And they're starting to get a little bit more strong out now as they get over flight number three. And it's a game of inches is leading by about two lengths to Disco Inferno for Matt Cooper in second. And Baby Jane is in third, Rhythmic Room four. Under Liam Crescent on the outside is five as they take four. And then dress grain is six with roller six seven. I forget what I mean. Anyway, it's a game of inches. He's making it a game of lengths at the moment, by leading by four of them. And Disco Inferno as they come up past the stand, past the water jump, past the big screen, and soon to pass the winning post. There they go. Swing out left handed. Now I think this is the remade Newbury. Looks the water jump looks like it's in a shoot out of the way. Well, it should be. They will use this course for the Hennessy in a few weeks. And all that ridiculousness where the water jump is the final fence. And it's, it's a game of inches in the lead, leading by five to six. The Disco Inferno second, and Anderley and Crescent third. And Baby Jane is back in fourth. It's rhythmic room after that one. And then the two at the back racing together a roller six and dressed grey. It's a game of inches. He's in the lead. All safely over number five. Under the end, Crescent now clear second. Or oh, Derek Hinton. Disco Inferno third. As they head towards flight number six of the 11. So this is the midway point in the hurdling. just lost his place a bit now his baby Jane shuffled to the back and it's been given a mid-race breather or just a back pair dressed grain and roller six starting to make a bit of a forward move as they get over number seven and it's a game of inches is clearing the lead still and leads by a good four lengths at this point Disco Inferno is second and the end present is third roller six has moved smoothly through into fourth Baby Jane is now starting to get going again as Rhythmic Room is the one that's dropped away. Dressed Grain has dropped back to the back. It's a game of inches. And it's four to five lengths clear. With four flights still to take. Big long straight as well at Newbury. Baby Jane has moved through into second. Disco Inferno has been steady in third pretty much all the way around. Roll of six is starting to make a forward move now as Andalie Crescent drops away. Dressed Grain is trying to get going but looks a bit one pace. Rhythmic Room has completely dropped out the back. Over the fourth last they go. And it's a game of inches. He's in the lead being chased by Baby Jane in second. Disco Inferno is moving out to the outside now and starting to Make a bit of a forward move as well as they get over to third last, but it's a game of inches is well clear. Looks to be going one in the lead. With the stable it's from, you wouldn't put a lot of money on anything catching it. They get over to second last and head down towards the final flight. And I would suggest that it's a game of inches has just got to jump this. It shouldn't be too difficult considering how small these hurdles are. They got over it nicely. Good jump by Baby Jane in second, who's closing the gap, but nowhere near quick enough. 
it's a game of inches is going to take base two on day three. Oh, Joshua Sutherland, it's a game of inches, the winner. Baby Jane is second. Dress Grade is third. Roller Six is going to be fourth with Disco Inferno fifth under them Crescent and finally Rhythmic Room. So Joshua Sutherland, Sister Leon, Run Rensburg, whatever you do, I'll match it. And he wins one straight after to keep the battle between their pair of them going. Right from week one then. So it's, it's a game of inches. Josh was sort of the winner. Baby Jane for David Robertson second. Dressed Grain James Shea third. Roller six Craig Beckwith fourth. And Disco Inferno for Matt Cooper was back in fifth.